A very big hello to all my Comet K champions out there. I hope you are doing really, really great, Bacha Party. So, my dear children, from today onwards, what is going to start? The mock round choice filling is going to start. So, today is 18th of July, and it was notified that at 4 p.m. 18th of July, the mock round choice filling would be active. And it would be active for how many days? Just for two days. So, these two days are going to be really, really crucial for you guys, right? Because you have to fill in the choices out there along with the courses the college the code and everything you have to take care of a lot of things and i am pretty sure there might be some people out there who have not made up their list until now probably because you don't have someone to guide you probably you were too lazy whatever your reason might be now it's high time to do the work because the round one counseling will soon begin my dear children so as of now over here you have to fill in your choices and i want you to pay attention that is you have to fill in the choices just like how you would fill in during round one why because this is very important when you fill in the choices and based on it when you get the result you will have an understanding where you went wrong or are you doing things correctly or not so depending on the choices you are filling you will be getting the mock round allotment result as well okay you will be you might be allotted with the college that you love okay you might not be allotted with any college out there or probably you might be allotted with the college that you just randomly put out there so you should have an understanding of how things work with the list that you are going to make and here i am telling you that we have a tool for you guys as well so for kct aspirants we gave the tool now it's your turn okay so with the help of this tool basically you can have a rough idea of what all colleges you should be putting in your choice filling round for the mock allotment as well okay and it is uh, there along with the course of example i want csc so i would be looking for computer science and engineering i want information uh, uh, information science then i will be looking for iac whatever courses you're looking for you can look for that and depending on the rank that you're getting it will be showing up the colleges that you should probably put up in the list out there and how you can access it that is the question and before that i want to tell you one more thing this tool is strictly based on the cutoffs okay so it will just tell you that these are the options that you can put according to the cutoff which was there for the previous year but please understand whatever colleges it shows up you have to do your own research as in you have to take those colleges go to the website and check for the placement rate for the faculty quality for the infrastructure do not just rely on the cutoff this is just to give you an idea okay these are the colleges that you can put in but what are the exact colleges you should put in you should be doing that research from your end i hope that's clear so my dear children there's a link given in the description section go to that and click on that now once you click on that something like this will be opening up yeah and over here the thing is comet k 2025 choice filling zip file so this is zipped file so over here you have to click on the three dots and click on download i'm doing it live so that you understand things better so i just clicked on the three dots and i clicked on download my thing have got downloaded over here comet k 2025 choice filling tool so i now click on that something like this opens up okay comet k 2025 choice filling now over here since i'm not very comfortable to put it right over here anywhere in the in the uh, what do you call in the pc i am going to take it somewhere safe probably towards the desktop because there there are no many folders so what do i have to do my dear children i have to just copy it and take it to the desktop you can do it in the same manner or probably you can access it from there also please take it somewhere safe okay now paste it now once you're done with that what do you have to do you have to click and what will happen there will be three things popping up so comet k uh, rank based college branch counseling this is the tool that i was talking about that is the first thing then you have the cutoff for the previous year you can you can just look forward to it if you want then there is seat matrix in the fee structure that is updated this year you can look forward to that as well so these are the all the documents that you will be needing for the on online counseling processes which we just clubbed and put it over here now what is our uh, what do you call zone of interest we want to access the tool so for that first thing we have to right click on that do not directly open i'm telling you again do not directly open you have to do the right click go to properties you can see it here go to properties and my dear children all of things all of these things would be visible you have to go to this file came from another computer and might be blocked to help protect this computer tab 
okay it is visible over here so what you have to do as of now it is blocked so for unblocking that you have to put a tick mark over here you just have to click on there and then click on okay now once you do that do not worry your pc would not your pc would not be having any virus if at all you download it okay do not be suspicious about anything now now if you open it it will smoothly open up okay now over here my dear children yes if at all it is mentioned that macros have been disabled just click on enable content if at all it is there if at all it is there what you have to do just click on enable content if it is there now my dear children here is the tool so what you have to do is you just have to put down your rank over there i'm just going to click on one okay and then you have to click the branch that you you want to look forward for for example i will be going ahead there's a drop down over here okay yo yo okay i'm back so basically it's uh, what do you call the pc out there which is why it becomes a little more difficult okay if you do it in the pc there rather than doing it in a touch screen it becomes very easy so there's a drop down you have to choose your course i am going ahead with computer science and engineering for that i have to go down okay here we have computer science and engineering i'm clicking that and now for viewing the result i have to click on view results and ta da there are list of colleges popping up there starting with what starting with rv college of engineering with the college code and the cut off rank which was there for the previous year now your rank is not this much obviously then you would have to go down depending on whatever rank is there for example your rank is around 50000 then go down so these are the colleges that probably you can avail if your rank is 50000 So there is a college with fifty one thousand three hundred seventy as a cut off, and that is S D M College of Engineering. So, my dear children, depending on it, you can now see the list of colleges. And one more thing, I want to tell you is, okay, this is the college. This was the cut off the previous year. This year also the same cut off will be there, ma'am. So I'll just put this particular college. You are doing something very very wrong. This year, obviously, no one can predict the cut off. It can definitely vary. So you do not please make a list of colleges which is just five in number. You have you you have an option to put unlimited options out there, but you should know how to fill in the options. So first list of choices should be the ones that you want to get into, but you are pretty sure you will not get those colleges because they are far ahead your cut off. So you put those colleges. Then you put those colleges which you may or may not get. Then you put those colleges which you will definitely get. For example, your rank is fifty. Okay, so probably in the mid range you can put some colleges starting from thirty five to fifty five. Okay, and above it you can put colleges from twenty five to thirty five, and then below below that from fifty five to seventy five. So you can put these set of colleges out there. Depending on it, you will get a college. Please make sure you are doing this way. We'll help you with how to do the choice filling and things like that. We'll make videos on it. But as of now, I think this this uh, tool itself is going to help you in a in a better way. And I'm as I have told you, please take. the college go to the website and check for the details and then only fill in the option you don't have to randomly fill in options from here okay you should know how to use the tool wisely so please do that and if at all you need our help put it down in the comment section we are here to help you out and if at all you think that this tool or us we are helping you well then definitely let us know that as well and do not forget to subscribe to the channel if at all you are facing any problems while downloading it do let us know okay we are here to help you out and the macros are enabled disabled things would be coming up so if you do the properties thing just as i said it would not be coming up okay so it would be easy for you so do like that okay bye bye wishing you all the best take care